VPC flow logs allow you to capture IP traffic information through your VPC. So it's very simple. You just have to turn this feature on um, at the VPC level, but you can scope it a few different ways. So you can have it for VPCs, for specific subnets, um, for specific ENIs, for specific transit gateways or transit gateway attachments. You can monitor traffic for things that are being accepted or things that are being rejected or all traffic. You can log the deliveries to Amazon S3 bucket, CloudWatch logs, Kinesis data fire hose. If you're wondering what um, an entry looks like within a VPC flow log, it has this entry format, which would be represented as something like this. To make it even more clear, we will just break down each line item here. So the first thing is version. This is the flow log version. We have the account ID of the AWS account that is um, uh, writing the log. We have an interface ID for the network interface. We have the source address, which is either IPv4 or IPv6. We have destination address. We have source port. We have destination port. We have the protocol. We have um, packets, so the number of packets being transferred. We have the number of bytes being transferred, the uh, start time in Unix seconds, the start or the end time in Unix seconds, the type of action. We have a few here. It's the accept, the reject. Then we have our log status, such as OK or no data or skip data. And so I think that is, I think there's just one little uh, part of the end there missing, but that's it, okay?